Sentient is a first-person adventure developed by Psygnosis and released on the PlayStation in 1997. It was also released for the PC the same year. Topic. Story There has been a breakout of radiation sickness on Space Station Icarus. The player character has been sent to investigate. After arriving at the station, it becomes apparent that radiation is only one of many problems, the captain is dead and a power struggle has ensued. To make matters worse, Icarus is on a collision course with the sun and nobody is able to correct the station's course. Sentient takes place in real time. The player's actions in the early part of the game determine which path they will travel through later on. Which members of the crew are spoken to and what they are told plays a strong part in the plot's development. The player's performance through the game determines which of the nine endings they receive. Topic. Development The game was developed by Psygnosis External Chester Studio and Pompeii Studios over 1995-1997. The characters in the game were based on facial scans of staff at the studio. The Windows version supports 3D acceleration, but only using the Matrox Mystique and the Creative Labs 3D Blaster. Early in the game's development, Mitch Gittleman of Pompeii Studios stated, The organic transmission of information was one of our primary design goals, along with logical, non-linear plot developments. Gossip and information transmission between computer-controlled characters takes the multilayered scenarios down many different avenues. It is our hope that this human interaction system will allow for maximum replayability without compromising the many stories in the game. Reception At the time of release, the PlayStation version of the game was praised for its ambitious and intricate gameplay and its replay value, but criticized for its sloppy graphics, particularly the odd-looking character faces. Most critics expressed astonishment that the conversation system produces dialogue which is not only fairly complex, but generally sounds natural and realistic. Overall assessments were mostly positive. GameSpot likened Sentient to classic text adventures. Bonehead wrote in GamePro that, "...the intricacy and suspense make the brainwork rewarding and replayable, too, with six endings." Sean Smith of Electronic Gaming Monthly commented, "...Sentient gets some major points for originality. I've never played a game with so many different possibilities." Dan Shu and Crispin Boyer felt that the pace was too slow and would be unappealing to many gamers, while Sushi X shared Smith's more positive assessment. A Next Generation reviewer concluded, ultimately, Sentient succeeds at what it set out to do, which was to forge some new territory in graphic adventures. <laughs>